Finally, my new wheels have finally shipped. Ah. Custom forged, all wood construction as you can see. Custom bark tread. Should fit perfectly with the rest of the wheels that I already have. Should make for some good uh, traction. So uh, after putting on all these uh, perfectly crafted studs here, as, as you can probably tell, you know, the old coupling knot and uh, some perfectly good welds there. Screw this doohickey right on to. About like so. finished them. It took a long time to build these things. These things are uh, an interesting piece of uh, engineering. Here. I'll let you take a look for yourself in there. Not, not as I would call probably perfect. I mean, they work. Kinda. These wheels are probably some of the farthest things you could get from around. But, uh, it works, you know? Kinda got the, the street look to it. I like it. So far it's been working good. I'm gonna go do some more testing with it here pretty quick now. Hope you guys enjoy. attempt a log running over a log never been done before ever
It's a little burnout though. So they say electric is the future. I beg to differ. Introducing the all green, all natural log wheel. Reusable, sustainable, burnoutable, and uh, floatable, and very rough riding. Oh, would you look at that? Nothing broke. Why am I stopped though? Yeah. Uh -huh. Ah. We go again. You made it through the mud hole, no problem. Like, surprisingly easy. I thought I was gonna get stuck in here for sure. Turns out all this, this bark is a uh, really good traction, like I thought it would be. I mean, I know this isn't a very big mud hole by any means, and my boots are But, uh, yeah, made it through, no problem. Very capable machine. You know, I think that is definitely capable of climbing like a vertical mountain, no problem. Like, you see like Mount Everest, and then like, this thing's like doing donuts up Mount Everest. You feel me? Catch my drift, man. Cause maybe I will go drift in this thing. You know, man? Uh, it was just like right there. Yeah. Good job in, you're wrong.